A long-running tradition continues in Sylacauga, but with a different face. Eric Freeman takes us to the B.B. Comer Memorial Library for this year's Snake Show. The Yarborough family has been educating and entertaining children of all ages for 51 years. Carrying on the tradition is Rebecca Yarborough Tucker, who was in Sylacauga at the B.B. Comer Memorial Library as a part of the library's summer children's program. Yes, sir, what a great experience here. They were packed out. I think they probably had to turn some away. They were out the door, but great audience. They were listening and learning. Um, I didn't expect to do a venomous program for them, but when I got here, we were prepared. So uh, I hope they learned a lot, and I hope that we, uh, if nothing else, we could save a lot of lives by you know the things that we do uh, share with them. Miss Stoker says she is very fortunate to carry on her parents' legacy. Well, I'm very fortunate to carry on my parents' legacy. Uh, my dad was a herpetologist, and uh, this is our 51st year of the snake show. A lot of people, I hate to say this, but your age, and maybe even your parents' age, remember the snake show back in the day. Uh, after his passing, my mother did continue. Uh, for some reason, I just want to move back home, and uh, I, now I know why. <laughs> it was just meant to be about two years after I moved back from Florida. Uh, she passed away of colon cancer and asked me to do the programs and of course I'm not a herpetologist but I could sure share a lot of information that I learned because I grew up around them. It's been a really a fantastic life, very odd, it's definitely not the normal but I told everybody I was born this way so. <laughs> Reporting from the Marvel City of Sylacauga for TV24 Primetime News, I'm Eric Freeman.